How to use the Focus Zoom module. For focus control compatibility, your lens must have distance markings around its focus ring. For zoom control compatibility, your lens must have focal length markings around its zoom ring. Lenses without any markings around any of its rings are not compatible with the Focus Zoom module. The Focus Zoom module requires a gear around the lens's rings to operate. If your lens does not have built-in gears, you can use the lens gear included with the Focus Zoom module. Place the rod, included with Head Plus, into its slot beneath the camera plate and tighten it. Slide the Focus Zoom module onto the rod. Align the gears, then press it against the lens while tightening the knob. Ensure all connections are firmly tightened to prevent any slipping. Connect the module's cable. After attaching the module, you'll see the lens loading screen. If you've attached the module to your lens's focus ring, select your lens from the list. If your lens isn't listed, try searching the lens community for a previously mapped file. Or if you want to map a new lens, select Add New Lens. When you start the lens mapping procedure, the focus zoom module will first attempt to locate the macro position on your lens. Confirm once it identifies this position. Next, you will be prompted to turn the focus wheel until you reach the infinity. Then, press Done. The focus will move back to its macro position. Next, input the current distance marked on the lens into the app and confirm your entry. Continue entering the remaining distance marks by first rotating the focus ring by hand to the next marked distance on the lens, and then entering that distance into the app. When you reach the infinity mark on the lens, enter 99 in the app. Finally, name your lens. This completes the mapping process. Your new lens activates instantly. The limit of the lens is calibrated again. Enter which end of the focus the lens is at and your lens is ready to use. If you wish, you can also upload this map file to the lens community so it can be recalled from any mobile device. If you want to simply pull focus from point A to B, you can use the key pose mode. This mode lets you save a specific focus position to a key pose, along with the positions of all other axes in the system. Once recorded, you can move the entire system, including the focus, seamlessly from one saved key pose to another. When Head Plus is fixed to a stationary point, using key pose mode for focus control delivers excellent results. However, if Head Plus is moving, this mode may be insufficient. If you want to achieve successful focus results while Head Plus is in motion, we recommend using the Point mode. The Focus Zoom module enables autofocus pulling in Point mode. When you enter Point mode and activate a point, the focus becomes live and actively tracks your subject as you move closer or farther away. The top right corner of the screen displays the live distance, which is the distance between your subject and the camera's sensor plane. Switching between points transitions the focus from one point to the other. If autofocus tracking misses focus, try these methods to improve the autofocus performance. Focus shifting. While a point is active, adjust focus with the focus dial until the subject is sharp. Teach point again. Delete and reteach the point. Load the lens again. Press change lens and reselect your lens to recalibrate its starting position. Recalibrate point mode. Navigate to settings, device settings. Recalibrate. 
This will erase all saved points and positions. Map the lens again. Create a new lens map, then load it. Stop down the aperture. A slightly smaller aperture will increase depth of field. Applying these methods will help you get much better focused shots. If you have attached the focus zoom module to your lens's zoom ring, select zoom control on the lens loading screen. The focus zoom module will automatically determine the zoom range limits and prompt you to specify the current zoom position. Provide this information to complete the lens calibration process. In the key pose mode, your current zoom position is recorded directly to each key pose and recalled whenever you press that key pose. In point mode, zoom levels are saved to the active point in real time. Whenever you return to that point, the last zoom level you used is recalled. If you need to change lenses during shooting, press Change Lens to return to the lens loading screen. Select your new lens or select Zoom Control and complete your lens loading process. By clicking on the slow, medium or fast text on the focus control wheel in the app, you can adjust the adjusting sensitivity of the wheel. You can access other video guides related to the use of Edelkrone products in the help section of our website.